Hey guys, it's Matt. This is a, a 124 scale, scale. I got it from Hobby King. It's made by Basher. It's called the Rockster. Um, I messed with it a cool, couple times. It's an MOA style, um, which motor on axle. Uh, and it can also four wheel steer with a couple different modes. What I really like about this controller though is I'm sure it'll hook to my Fly Sky uh, receivers as well. I'll just flip it up. Sorry about the blinking green light. I think it does that when it's hooked up, but you can see it's got the. See if we can get it the steering modes, all your normal adjustments. But I got a little little area that I put together for the little trucks and run power around it and see how she does. Oh, well, it's a really nifty little buggy. Good weight to it. And I have it on four-wheel steer right now. Running a 450, 450 milliamp 2S four-wheel battery. It already comes with a JST. Plugs already on it, ready to go. It does not come with a LiPo battery, however. Can't really tell if it has a drag brake on that. Just, uh, I'll definitely leave a link for these in the description. I got the most wheel speed, but it seems to have enough to do the job. And this four wheel steer definitely helps. Turn radius, that was awesome. Very good auto control on the truck too. Very responsive. to the camera not the truck huh? and it comes with right. a drag brake auto drag brake going on Uh, hung up on the front. Try a different, try a different approach. <laughs> well, there's that one, guys, and I will definitely leave a link in the description for this one. Very wicked little truck. 
<laughs> very, very cool. And it does have three wire servos. So servos are going to be able to be upgraded. And I'm sure that there'll be a way to do the motors. They do offer motor I gears and motor replacements. So, um, like I said, I'll leave a link in the description for this one, guys. And I'm going to link this with a video for the B17. Betty Axial SEX24, and we'll see how it does. This one walked over the whole course, so I'm excited to see how that one's going to do. All right, guys, this is my Axial SEX24 B17 Betty Edition. Shout out to Medic. I want to see Sparks. Uh, you guys have seen these, I'm sure. The 24s, there's enough videos out there. Controllers, pre standards. Not, don't feel bad, whatnot. But uh, I just took uh, my other one, 24 scale, um, made by Basher from Hobby King, and uh, brought it around the track. Did pretty good. And so we're going to drive this one around. That back spring is kind of sticking. I might need to put some, spray a little bit of oil on there. I've not done anything to them. Both of them are stock, so this is just stock comparison. I ain't put no, I ain't put any weights or anything on it. This one does go faster than the other one. I have it on the third setting, which I agree with RC athletes. I think it just lowers the voltage. It doesn't actually, it's not a gear change deal. Nice drag brake though. A lot bouncier than the other one. The suspension on these is a lot bouncier than that other one. That, that seemed a lot smoother. But it walked right up it. And that's a pretty good angle, guys. I don't know if I can really judge it too much because of the way, but my phone's pretty much level. So that's how much of an angle it was going up. Now, of course, the other one does have a little bit better of a turn radius because it does have four-wheel steer capability. I ain't going to do that to this one because it's a limited edition, but I see a couple more of these in my future. In a better course. This is just some stuff I threw together to, so me and Savannah can play with the trucks. Get out of that. Oh, yeah, them LEDs are bright. Oh. Hung her up on the axle, guys. Might be able to get it off. Oh. Yeah, we got her off there. No touch, but might pay for it on a roll off here in a minute. Landed on her wheels, but still. Let me put it back up here. Had a roll off. Didn't have that with the other one. That might have just been my driver now. Trying to do both. So this one definitely sits a little bit lower, I think, too, than the other one. But now this one, there's a lot less pumpkin to worry about than what there is on the MOA because you have the whole motor. That's a nice shot. 
Yeah, the road bridge. I'm going to have to concentrate on this one, guys. On the strap bridge, I suppose. to run with my Axio SCX24. I'm definitely going to get these out and about a little bit more. I'm really having fun with these little trucks. So, until next time, we'll see what's in store. Like Medic says, get out and have fun with RC. Or if it's cold out, like where it is most of the place in the country, America and right now, and stay inside and maybe build something. Till next time, guys. Later.